So right now, we are at Evergreen Cemetery in Portland. This is one of my favorite places to come, especially during the fall. You can see some of the leaves in the background. The trees are just so spectacularly colored right now. You can see a lot of people taking walks with their dogs, with their families. Everyone loves to come out and see the fall leaves right now. This cemetery was modeled after another cemetery called Mount Auburn in Massachusetts, which was the first rural cemetery in New England. This cemetery was designed so that people could come and enjoy the art, the sculptures, and nature out here when it was a rural area next to Portland. And the pathways were designed for carriages to ride up and down. After the cemetery was built, they actually built a railway all the way from Portland, all the way up here, which was then called Westbrook, just so people could come enjoy the cemetery. Now it's a part of Portland. So you might be surprised to hear that there's over 50,000 people buried here, and it has over 40,000 monuments in this entire cemetery. So when I first moved across the street, I thought that the only people in the cemetery would be visiting loved ones. But what I found out shortly after is that so many people come here to walk their dogs, to take a walk with their families. You'll see a bunch of people with their baby strollers. I see a lot of hikers, um, a lot of mountain bikers using the biking and hiking trails, and just a lot of people out enjoying nature every day. Even in the winter, you see cross-country skiers here. So it's a real uh, meeting place for everyone, and we all really love it a lot. So it's been around about 150 years, and I think that's one of the things that adds such beauty to this area is how big the trees are, how long they've been here, how old the gravestones are, all of the sculptures, all of the art that's been here for so long. They just don't make it like that anymore. And you can tell by how many people visit here a day, how much we all appreciate it. My favorite part of Evergreen Cemetery are the duck ponds in the back because every spring my kids and I come and see the ducks hatch and we love to find the baby ducks and count them and see how many there are. My son loves to catch frogs in the same ponds and there's a bunch of snapping turtles that come back every year. So this is the turtle log and when the sun is out and it's warm, you can see all of the turtles dotting this log all the way down. It's really cute. I always like seeing how the person died or how they were related. So you see Martha is the daughter of the two parents. Elizabeth G is the daughter, so she was buried. The woman of the house always has just wife under her name. And then the dad probably passed a little earlier. And that's a really old gravestone. It's really weathered. You can barely read it out. My name is Chelsea Graves. I've lived a lot of places and my family and I moved here to Portland six years ago and I joined the Lifestyle Properties team at Keller Williams. I really love the team. I've had such a great time there. I work with some really, really great people. definitely come to Evergreen Cemetery. It's one of the places I always tell my friends to come visit.